Let's have a look. Collect my gun, but where'd I collect it from? Actually, that's a little better. Oh, so it's this thing. Iconic items. You just receive an iconic item along with a set of crafting specs. You use this to craft better quality ver versions of this item when a new version of iconic item is created. Oh, the original item is destroyed. Cool, cool. Thanks a lot. Any loot around here? Aha! Oh, just ammo. Okay. We can't do the gig yet. Let's do this get this grip of that. The gift, this part. Uh. Papa. That doesn't sound good. Wait, can we craft now? Oh. What is this? Oh, huh. all right. So we, we can craft uh, health potions, or not health potions, but health items, if we really wanted to. Cool. Awesome. No tradition. The sponsor for the festival is the Arasaka Corporation, and in an exciting development, even Anako Arasaka has announced her participation in the Dashi Parade. From all of us at WNS News, we wish you a safe and fun night. Let's see. So, uh, are we gonna talk about yesterday? It's all in the report. Oh, I read it. Except there's no mention of me telling you to delta the fuck out of there. Yeah, no biggie. Not like that cyber psycho was a tank on two chrome legs. What the fuck were you thinking? There's a reason Max Tack exists, you know. Civilians were in danger. What was I supposed to do? Just watch them get mowed down? Listen, you, me, and every fucking cop in this city might as well be a civilian next to MaxTac. The day they give us the gear they're packing, go right ahead. Be the hero. Save the fucking day. But until then, you keep your head down and listen to me. That understood? Oh, huh. okay. That's cool. What is this? NCPD scanner hustlers. They'll pay you to help fight crime. Fixers contract you when you approach a gig's location. Fixers, these intermediates will inform you about local gigs available. Okay. 
this? Oh, that's to sell stuff. Cool. Man of the hour. <laughs> Jeez, took you long enough. Worked up an appetite just waiting. Sit down. Let me finish this. Then we can drop in on Senor Vector. Didn't figure you was a type for Asian. Would have thought you'd find it too exotic. What do you mean? What's there not to like? Noodles? Check. Since sirloin? Check. Get some more chile action up in here, and you're looking at Mama <laughs> Wells' signature sopa de fideos. <laughs> Mention something about a surprise. Yes. Oh, that looks so good. I'm, I'm so hungry. Ah. Uh. Probably both, because you usually forget shit. But it just so happens, I think I might have bagged us a sweet ass J O B. Go on. I mean, maybe it's not as big as that, but just that he's fronted by a little known someone named Dexter Deshaun. Totally the top fixer in night fucking city. Fat ass black Jesus of the afterlife. 300 pounds of partly gold plated cool. Dexter Deshaun? What's the latest spec on him? I know you got info to spill. He's been off the grid for about two years. Word on the street was he took a little vacay. Two years? That's exile, not a vacation. What was he up to? Uh, guessing he shoved pizzas in his mouth while jerking off the hardcore virtues. <laughs> the important thing is he's back. It's a fresh crew. How'd you manage to pull this? Trade in your spleen or something? <laughs> as far as I know, we're not the type to get fingered by Dex. You know me? Oh, but T Bug. Phrasing, please. He's the one that hooked us up. <laughs> Got us talking. Knew it was a done deal the moment he laid eyes on me. Cause come on. Ain't nobody who can resist this. Am I right? <laughs> sure, Jack. Whatever you say. So, what's the gig? We meant to come out in one piece? Our Lord and Savior wants to tell you everything himself, face to face. Oh, no pressure, but uh, this whole deal, he's riding on you now, I see. Why do I gotta go? You and T-Bug draw straws without me? <laughs> T-Bug and Dex go way back, and my face is yesterday's news. Oh, Dex says he needs to check you, talk to you. Look, V, it's his job, his rules. I can't blame him for taking a personal approach. And it ain't as bad as you think, okay? Trust me. Guess I got no choice then. Dex is a real deal when it comes to fixers. Don't get me wrong. Don't got nothing against the Padre or Wakako, but Dex is a leader of his own. You know what I'm saying? Don't get me started on fixers. They catch a client, find the cheapest gong to do the job, then drop their corpse at a landfill. Shit. Hit the nail on the head, B. Gracias, Dios. Oh, you know. Brought your wheels. Gave them to my guy yesterday to smooth over the dents after our, uh, dust up with the scabs. Thanks, Jack. Much appreciated. Some top-notch work Miguel did. Rides like it looks. Factory new. We'll see about that. So we rolling or what? Let's feel this factory new ride. I'm fine. First stop. Ripper Duck. And Holmes. Easy on the gas, huh? I just ate. I was supposed to stop by Vicks anyhow. I got a date. Me and Misty. You don't say. She's so sweet. Really gets me, you know?
Jesus, come on. Bad turn here. Find me once Vic's done dusting your circuits. We'll hash out what Dex has cooked up for us. It's Jack and Coke. Nice. Not only to you. <laughs> Do you truly believe that those who have Gary. sold you your mechanical eyes have resisted the temptation to peek through them? Hey, look at this, Coke Carnage. Cameras are all around us. Even within us, your joys, your worries, your life, for them it is all mere spectacle. Yeah, if anyone was watching and giving a damn, I'd have half the city's underworld and half its corpse on my ass already. And if you are their pawn, unknowingly carrying out their <laughs> secret agendas. Okay. But who are those who follow our every step, you ask? Why, the titans of entertainment in Alpha Centauri! In their wretchedness, they placate their weary and oppressed oh, masses oh by putting our laughter, our tears, oh on full what display! Get next to him. I'll snap still if you are arresting him for revealing government secrets. Open your mind before it is too late! <laughs> will, like, die when she sees this. You, you okay, bro? Like, this is Max Nova. I just can't. All right, cool. Radio waves, bear the truth. Let those with ears listen and those with eyes behold. <laughs> hey, V. Dr. Vector will see you now. I'll sit tight over here. Me and Misty got a little catching up to do. What's up, Misty? You look pleased. Vicky, surprise every Through common practice, cyberware installation is still a dangerous and invasive procedure, which can only be performed by quality specialists, ripper docs ripper docs. There are several rip docs operating throughout Night City who offer a variety of different cyber upgrades. Cool. The old ripper? It's good to see it. Good to see you too, V. Oh, wow. So what do I owe the pleasure today? Last gig. Had to jack into a client's neurosocket. I think I might have gotten spiked. Experiencing migraines, nausea, hypersensitivity to bright lights. Whole kit and caboodle. All right, kit. We'll sort you out in a flash. Besides that, how are things? Met a new fixer. He gave me a job. Name's Dexter Deshawn. Known quantity from the afterlife. No denying you're moving up. But something you're not telling me, Vic? Keep your guard up, that's all. I've heard some things about Dex. He's not as chill as he makes himself out to be. Need some new kit, but tools, not toys, Vic. Time I bumped up my sights and got a grip. <laughs> really? Now? Finally? Vic, shit's getting real. Got a job from Dex to Sean, hitting the major leagues. Need tech that can perform. The Dexter Deshaun? <laughs> well, that is something. But let me guess. Hasn't paid you yet. Quit crying, Vic. I'll bring you the Eddies later, with interest. You know I will. That's a lot of money. Mm. Last time, you hear? Chair, please. Sit down and relax. Kuroshi Optics. Best I've got, and should be about right under the circumstances. Now jack in. Kuroshi? Whoa. Vic, nothing tops that on the market. 
Hmm. Sounds like it could come in handy then. I gave you my word I'd pay you back, but this might be too rich for my blood. We'll work something out. Right now, I'm just out to make sure you get back in one piece. Eddie's in hand. Thank you, Victor. You peruse and choose while I scan. We'll see what's going on inside. Cybernetic implants are medical or machinical replacements for organic parts of your body. They give you superhuman like abilities which can improve your combat capability. Help you survive dangerous situations. Okay, cool. Oh. Huh. Oh, they this all cost money, which I don't have. Those are expensive. Memory boost. Huh. Cool. I think that's all for it. Oh, what can I do with my hands? Cool. Anything new I can? Steve, that is it. Mark one, like I said. Decent enough scanner. Displays data on your cornea. Cherry on the top's a built-in external lens disruptor. In layman's terms, any surveillance cam will capture your face as a blur. And just remember, your body will still show up as crystal clear. Hmm. This should do the trick. Talks to Kuroshi Tech, too. I'm ready. Carve away. Excellent. Let's do this. Lay that major league arm of yours right here. So, what's new in the life of Victor Vector? <sighs> yeah, if I'm being honest, not much. And that's fine with me. I used to live in a world where all that mattered was who's who, what's what, and how's why. And what happened? One day, I just dropped it and never looked back. I'll never be a legend in this town. I've been sleeping nights ever since. Just like that. Thanks. Now, a bit of anesthetic and I can start cutting. Feel anything? Play by play, though. Really, Doc? Makes it sound like a dentist. Always <laughs> going on and on. Don't be mean now. Remember, I'm old. I got a shaky Gannick hand. Could slip. Lights out for a minute, all right? That's the worst feeling. Like, like, what's my reach for your eye oh, in the game? Yeah. is like, Let's oh, it hurts. See the magic in action. Linking you in. You might feel a little discomfort at first. Blurred vision, low contrast, glitches. Well, how's it look? Feel all right to you? Oh, this is fantastic, Vic. <laughs> oh, beautiful. Scanning people with your optical cyberware can provide you with a lot of inform useful information. This is how strong an enemy might be, who's in the crew, and what type of weapon they use. As a skilled netrunner, you can see a list of quick hacks we can use against your enemies. Cool. Time for the scanner. Take you a 
few seconds to adjust. But first time's rarely the charm, <laughs> with anything, really. The scanner should eventually sync with your thought processes and read your intentions. I also inject an NCPD file search. Run into any cool. ne'er do wells? <laughs> you know exactly what they ne'er did well. Database of individuals with bounties assigned to them, now available to use. You can identify this wanted person through the scanner. Since all, wanted, since, the, since all are wanted dead or alive, the methods you use to claim your reward are entirely up to you. Cool. <laughs> it ought to work like a charm. Now draw your weapon. You should see your ammo count in a brand new site. Ooh. How about the neurovirus from the last job? Can you check it? Done and gone while we were putting in your implant. And a full sweep on your soft and circuits. Zap the critter. You're certified bug free. Cool, thanks, man. Shit, Victor, not bad. I don't know what to say. Say you'll take this and remember the dosage. Two whiffs now, and another two in an hour. What am I looking at? A mild stem. Should boost neurotransmission in the short term and muffle some of the side effects while the implant takes. Thanks again, Vic. You're the best. I owe you. Go on, kid. Show them what you're made of. And once you hit the big leagues, don't forget where you came from. <laughs> of course. Who's winning? Hernandez. You know, in the old days, that cripple Malone would have been flat on the boards. Now every last fighter's got extra skull lining. Absorb 75% <laughs> of every... V? Fine, fine, fine. I'm coming. out for negative energy fields and avoid mean reds v, yo listen up i talked to dex while you were in with the doc hmm. he's waiting in his ride for you ain't but a hop to where he's parked next to gramsci burgers okay do my best to talk us up v listen i've got this delicate matter that's why i called you the number of cyber psycho attacks in the city is on the rise. Now that's probably not news to you, but this issue matters to me for a few reasons. There are people who say cyber psychosis can be treated. Right. And I know exactly how that sounds, but I believe even an unproven therapy is still better than a bullet to the brain. If I get a tip about a possible attack, I'll give you a call. Maybe you can investigate before Max Tech hits the scene. But remember, you're not there to execute anybody. Try to incapacitate the attacker, and I'll send someone to pick him up. I hope Keyword. that's all clear. Try to. Fine. What is life without its body? What are the beings of the net if not souls from beyond our plane of existence? I have heard their voices. Let they who yet live never cross that threshold. For their you heard souls. their voices? What did they say? They spoke not in the language of mortals, no. They howled, screaming in agony, forever removed from their earthly form. Among them was a woman, her voice of ice, Queen Lilith. She was calm, <laughs> but at the cost of her humanity. <laughs> you ask, who opened these unholy gates of the abyss? All right. No Good one's talk. asking. <laughs> and I answer, the techno necromancers of Alpha Centauri. Cool. <laughs> Alrighty. 
Ba, ba, ba. What's up, Dex? Huh. He fell, right? Okay. Mr. V, a pleasure. Dexter Deshaun in the flesh. Ample indeed. <laughs> Let's roll. Mind if I ask you something right off the bank? Would you rather live in pieces, Mr. Nobody, die ripe, old, and smelling slightly of urine, or go down for all times in a blaze of glory, smelling near like posies, without seeing your 30th? It's first place or no place, Dex. Cost isn't a factor. <laughs> Classic. I'd expect nothing less from eager, supple youth. Respect. All right, listen close. Scanning a serious job now. Playing gargantuan compared to smashing up a scab home. Hang on. I got a question of my own now. Why all this, Dex? Why me? Could have had Jackie or T-Buck sitting here. Could have just done this on comms. Call me old-fashioned, but I like to look anyone I do biz with in the eye. Had the pleasure of meeting the Jackster in the past, and sweet T-Bug helped this brother out two years ago. So here we are. Besides all that, got a special little pre-mission just for you. But we'll get to that. Let me hear it. What's the job? There's this prototype tech, a biochip to be precise. Job to grab it. Simple. Yeah. Guessing it belongs to a corp. Mm-hmm. Arasaka. Surely that's no problem. <laughs> Corps don't deserve special treatment. Shit, <laughs> you ain't playing around. Got a feeling this could be a start of a beautiful friendship built on heaps of eddies. You work this out? Got a plan? Two things. First, a conundrum with the Maelstrom boys. Needs active resolving that. Second, the rendezvous. Simple. Client who brought us the job's anxious. She wants to parlay with one of the team. What's the issue needs resolving with Maelstrom? Got a beef? Slot in the shard. <laughs> Got a classic tale for you. Psycho gang doing his thing two weeks back. Jumped a Militech convoy. Got away with the gear. Corp don't even know Maelstrom's involved. Now see, convoy was carrying the flathead. A little combat bot, a prototype. And I need me that bit of high grade military. If we don't get that bot, we don't get no soccer chip. And we sure as hell don't get no happily ever after. But don't get excited. It's a single-use toy. Now, I flat out purchased the damn thing from Maelstrom. Problem is, I did so from a gent went by the name of Brick. I say when, because Brick was the leader. Three days after we'd sealed our deal, his friend and gangmate one Simon Randall, a.k.a. Royce, plain dropped his ass. Oh. Royce is in charge now, and I got no way of knowing if he aimed to honor his predecessor's word. To add to this ship's room, one Meredith Stout of Militech has developed an interest in said convoy. Royce guy, what's he like? A straight psychopath, chrome-loving kind. Big club in this town. I'll give you that, except few of its other members. No matter the stakes, would put a friend and associate through an industrial microwave dryer. Apparently, first thing to burst are the eyeballs. Get a nice clear pop. Then the rest goes goulash. <laughs> 